Hi everyone, Masella here from Learn to Grow. Today I want to share with you our results from another bacteria experiment. And I really want you to see the kids' reaction uh, to the bacteria. It's pretty funny. <laughs> Uh, so anyway, to help to grow bacteria, what you'll need is an auger plate. You can order this pre-made. I got mine from Amazon. I think it was a pack of 10 for around $21. And what they come with is the uh, prepared uh, petri dishes with the auger, the nutrient auger. I don't want to open this. But anyway, um, auger is made from a seaweed. So it kind of has a um, gelatin um, um, texture so it's like a bites a little harder and they use these for growing microorganism or bacteria because they can't eat through the the auger itself although it does supply them some nutrient for growth so you can order these auger plates or you can make um, your own auger plates you'll have to buy the um, powder um, mixture it's auger auger and you'll I think you have to cook it so I'd like this I'm using these better pre-made unless you're making a whole bunch for like a class or something um, but I think you're, you're okay buying it but it is um, more economical buying the um, mix the auger auger and then cooking it and preparing your own so um, the ones I ordered came with some swabs also I think it had about uh, 20 swabs these little swabs here and what you'll do is you swab you whatever you're swabbing if it's a cell phone or a sink you'll just swap it and then you'll smear it onto your auger um, plate here so I'm not going to open this up because I don't want to um, use it I'll sh you'll have to see what our results are so you'll just kind of smear it I'll show it this way like a zigzag and back and forth the other way and that's it so that's pretty much it what you do and to grow the bacteria you're going to place your auger plate upside down that way the lid is on the bottom and so the condensation will go on the bottom if there's there is any it doesn't and it won't um, get on the um, auger itself and you can put it inside a ziploc bag seal it tight seal it squeeze the air out then you place it upside um, upside down on a counter we prefer the bathroom counter since it's the warmest place in the house we don't have an incubator and uh, I think we got results within, within like a couple days, you know, and so on. You'll see more bacteria growth, but it's best to put in a warmer spot, um, the warmest place in your house. And I feel more comfortable putting in the bathroom rather than the kitchen counter. So, so anyway, so here's our um, video of the kids' reaction um, to the uh, growth of the bacteria. And I hope that you guys enjoy this episode of Learn to Grow. Um, no, also, um, we do have a second channel. It's under my name, Missilla D, but it's kind of like a learn to grow too, where I'm mainly going to be doing more arts and crafts in that channel and some DIYs, um, some more health stuff, um, natural health remedies and stuff like that, and fun things, fun projects for the kids. So um, I'm gonna try to focus on this channel mainly just for gardening and science experiments and some outdoor adventure stuff. So anyways, thanks again for tuning in. Have a wonderful day. You can see the label so you can read. You <laughs> or each um, specimen or bacteria oh, are oh where we swapped it from. Okay, what's that one? What does it say? That TV one? remote. Mm -hmm. Bathroom sink. Ill. Kitchen sink. Gross. Um, keyboard. Board. Ew, that's gross. Okay, mom's cell phone. Plant. Magnum's mouth. <laughs> Our dog's mouth. Yep. Yeah. Do you see um, dif the differences between each petri yeah. dishes? Yeah. Some of them look different from the others. And these ones look like mushrooms. Let me take a look. So this is from the plant. And see there's... Some of them are different colors. See the yeah. TV remote? It's got the pink. Yeah, the circle ones look like mushrooms mm -hmm. because they're white. Yep.
Hi, and we just want to say bye. And this is our bacteria. We just want to say bye. And stay cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.